WIR.com. I'm Chris Dosky back here at the Winter Bowling Center alongside Augie again. Uh, Mike, we got state mixed bowling that continues into the last weekend of the month. So how have the numbers been the last couple of weeks? Numbers have been real good. We're going to beat the last four-year average probably by about 10 teams. So we're setting around about 130 teams. So uh, that's better than the average. Can people still get signed up, or is there no room left? Uh, there is a few spots opened uh, along the way, you know, here and there. Friday nights are kind of open. Saturdays and Sundays are kind of full. So there are a few. So if anybody's interested, you still can sign up, yes. I mentioned it goes uh, till the last weekend of the month. So uh, what days does it go? Friday through Sunday, Saturday and Sunday? How's this go? Friday through Sunday, the next two weekends. So, And, of course, visitors are welcome to watch, right? Visitors are always welcome. Come out and watch some good bowling. You know, this is more of a social tournament and it is a serious tournament so there's a lot of good times out here and some good bowling in fact we had a guy from lemon throw his first 300 here last weekend so uh and of course you have the kitchen open still too while this is all going on right mexican food all that good stuff all that stuff's still going on too yep Micah, we appreciate the time good to visit with you again uh, i just want to say the leaders going into this weekend we have a team from winter leading leading the team uh, isaiah curtis Rhonda, jeff and ashley augsburger are leading it they actually took my team out, so we got a little family feud going on here. <laughs> took us out by 25 pins. And the doubles, there's a couple from uh, Watertown that are leading the doubles. So, He's a man that wears many hats here at the Winter Bowling Center. Mike, always good to visit with you. Thank you very much. Again, here at the Winter Bowling Center, alongside Mike Augsburger, I'm Chris Dosky for KWIR.com.